two, some of the youngest, brightest talents that are on the up and coming ranks in this country. So without further ado, the following contest is a singles match set for one form. Oh! Introducing first to the ring, please. One who often rocks the top knot, might not tonight, and the other one who has uh, uh, an afro, let's, let's call it that. No no racial appreciation there, just he's got big hair, but he's got a big future in front of him too, they both have. We've got the one, we've got Mark True. At some point he will be up there and he will be able to afford the other leg to his trousers. And he may also be coming for gold. I mean if you can find a tag team partner, can you imagine these whoa, 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 whoa. You drop your hat. We have got two very flippy boys in this next match. Yep, I do have a nickname for them, but I won't be using it yet. Yeah, our first trooper in the ring, and now let's change the music and introduce his opponent. Yes, Jake, let's do that. Do you think he became an announcer just because he enjoys the sound of his own voice? Because it is great to be very yes. fast. Yes. Yes. He's good at what he does, but yes. He's fine. He hasn't got a stash like yours, though. Ambiguity if he's from London. Where? Oh. Good luck, Mr. True. Oh, got him. Hesitation. What was that? I just, I don't know if I really want to associate with him yet. No, he sanitised his hands. I think. You didn't. Oh, okay. Ugh. <laughs> Gross. That'll be the stash wax. That will be the mustache wax indeed, because you do not get a mustache without this, without a handsome Jack beard wash. So I'll be on the merch table soon then. How do you know? Because you wouldn't even sell that. Well, I, it's my own secret patented formula. That sounds disgusting. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, we will not be selling that, because that's, that's vile. Um, but it is BPA free. Being pedantic, Arrogance? Uh, not tested on animals. 50% vegan, 100% of the time. Anyway. Hey! Xander hey. might be proud of that, wherever he is, bless him. They're going for a lockup. This is not what's expected, but they're not going to burn the cracker, like the firecracker straight away. Oh, oh, oh no, so I'm ringing there from, point, from Mark Tree. Hey, that, you know that? Will it? Oh, dear, snap man, nice. You see, they both flip it. Oh my god. Right, this he's going for the back body drop. No, he isn't. But do you notice that True still holds on to that hole? Well, look how. Oh, 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 oh. That is straight out of the handsome Jack playbook. Taught him that before the match. You taught him that before the match? Yeah, I taught him that before the match. I thought you were busy polishing your beard. I could do two things at once. Oh, okay. So that's why you're on comps and a shameless plug for the beard products. Absolutely. Fair enough. That's like my shameless plug that I know a guy who does merch. But anyway, let's move on, shall we? This is something you don't expect from high flyers, all right? They're obviously trying to break things down so that... Oh, God. It's not a chokehold, but that's going to stun the shoulders. But, but you're trying to break down the arsenal of a flipper. I absolutely feel like I'm currently watching a classic piece of Japanese wrestling. Without the masks, of course. This is hold to hold. Oh! Turnabout's for head play, nice. Wow. I mean, they're not quite the, the great Muta, but... Or Antinoki, no but, you know, they're, they're alright. They're like Tiger Mask and... Well, not done like Kid, but... You know, they're too small for that. But anyway, they are British. They are state taking the uh, country by storm. They've come into World War Wrestling. What's he going for? Is he going for... Is he, what's he going for? Oh, 
Whoa, 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 whoa. He's hitting him up there. I believe that might have been his patent, patented move to DPD. Whoa, reverse for the fans. We didn't deliver it that time, did he? Absolutely nobody at the door. Well, it's a Sunday, so he doesn't deliver on Sundays. Oh. Or maybe he will, I don't know. Come on, Matthew, keep him off the ropes. I'm sorry, it's Sunday. I have to use his full Christian name. I don't know his middle name. Yep, yeah, something like that. By the grace of God, hopefully these two don't hurt each other. Whoever he is. But anyway, step over. Nice. Lee. Oh! First pin. It was. The thing was with what? Nope, caught him. Sling shot. No, no, no. We. <laughs> this ain't Japanese, brother. Caught him. Turn round. What the? No. Oh, oh. is that like a court strip? Steps over. A I'm watching Matt Ball while he. I'm watching Matt Ball and. Oh, what? Look at. I feel like I'm watching one of those YouTube videos of young kids really quickly solving Rubik's cubes. You mean like Justin Bieber? You don't like him, but you've got to be impressed by him. Yeah. The IQ of a cotton bud, though, that boy. But anyway, a dirty one. Um, still, I'm looking at Matt Ball, and I have to say to him, I'm glad he's refereeing this show, because he's a very good ref, but also because refereeing something like this, nope, stand out the way, watch for the flips, and just, you know, duck. And he's out. I think Matt Ball's a very smart man, because I would not want to accidentally be on the receiving end of Dean O'Brien. He is a very smart man, because... He's well, you know, we don't refer. Oh, 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 it always worries me when these flip flop flyers decide to flip and not flop and fly towards the crowd. See, if this was me and I was uh, in Mark True's position right Hang now, hang on, there's a cover. No, no, sorry, kick out too. If I was in Mark True's position right now, I would probably just probably just win. We'd probably just win. Yeah, I'd probably just probably just win by now. There you go, ladies and gentlemen. We don't come on, pack it up. We'll go home because because the moustache. Hang on, is he going for a pin? Yes, yes. Oh, still not enough. See, I wouldn't have kicked out. I would have kept him down. I wouldn't have let him kick out. Well, if I was wrestling, which I don't ever want to do, I know how to beat you. I'll just pull you by your moustache. You'd be crying over it. I could, you know, small package. One, two, three. Done. That would be very unsportsmanlike of you. No, no less sportsmanlike than just winning <laughs> by whatever method besides when you get kicked twice in the face by Danny Blaze it kind of changes a person whoa oh that's an insecurity Nino staggered uh oh uh oh uh oh like a lawn dart <laughs> Matt Ball out of the way is like nope that's not for me thanks true up top Nihino on the floor That was that was an explosive elbow drop. It wasn't Randy Savage because Rat Macho Man and even CM Punk could go up top, do a bit of taunting, and then they jump a little bit and drop it. That was some crazy height there from. That two. was a Shane McMahon leap of faith. With without the injury layoff, hopefully. Unless he's facing an Undertaker and Rich Pest just stay down. Just stay down. He might be 105 and his interest may take 10 years, but just stay down. I reckon I could probably beat the Undertaker. Nope. Let's go for the pin again. You see, I know that I don't wrestle. Oh, me, I was a bit winded. But I know I don't wrestle, but I imagine that you'd use your coveted pin, which you'd put body on body, you'd trap the arms, and you'd hook the leg, because for you, you're quite a big, beefy boy, and you'd use that leverage. Absolutely. But you may get sidetracked by your stash. Oh, true. Is he going for that package pile drive? Uh, package pile driver? Yeah, I thought it was a package pile bomb. Nope. Still not done. Leg lariat, spinning back leg. Nice. Go for the pin again. See, there's still not enough body on body. He's wearing him down, but they're slippery slimy sods, the old flippy floppers. What Mark True needs to do is just keep him down for three. Ladies and gentlemen, handsome Jack Callahan has left the building. He's been replaced by Captain Obvious. 
It's like putting somebody in a submission move. The aim of the game is to make them tap. Yep, thanks, mate. Which is exactly what I would do if I put someone in a submission. Unless they pulled you by your stash. But again, Nino's on the outside. You can't beat him on the outside whether you're going to pin him for three because there's no pins on the outside. You can't make him tap because there's no submissions on the outside. But you can get him counted out if you hurt yeah. enough. Oh! That, that was a lot of force of the forearm there. But Mark Drew's going for it again. Is he going for the package pile driver? No package pile bottle. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Ow. Ow. That's like double bubble, though, because he's dropping the elbow right across the shoulder, which is going to knock that up. And as he does it, on the turnabout's fair play. But as he does it, his ribcage torso is also planting straight to the side of True. True. That. I don't imagine you'd be able to do that because, you know, you're dexterous, but that's a, that's quite quick. Oh. No, so I wouldn't have done that purely because if it was me, the match would have been over by now. Oh, yes, of course. The obvious one, two, three, that's how you win. Thanks exactly for that. that. And the tap, yeah, good. Brilliant. You might not be a wrestler, but you're really starting to understand. I'm a referee. I can't wrestle. I shouldn't wrestle. But I can count to three sometimes. But only when people kick out, I can't. Is he going for a split leg moonsault? No. Oh, 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 holy bananas. Wow. That's, that's a bit of spice right there. Okay, I'm going to use the nickname. I used it for Joe Lando, but he doesn't want it. These are some crazy mother flippers. <laughs> Their flips don't flop. Wait, uh, uh, anyway, let's, let's not do that. This is a family show. Someone needs to tell Sam Santari that. What, Shawn Michaels of Britwest? Yes. Absolutely. He's a good looking man. All the way from Helsinki. His glasses are good, he's got good hair. Not as good as Mr. Rebel Wrestling, because that falls that way, and he took the fall. He's not, he didn't win more trials. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, ha, 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 ha. Beautiful, vicious backbreaker. Something you'd do, I'd imagine, but that spins. Absolutely. Oh, wait, no, you wouldn't. As you said to me before, you'd have won already. My bad. Now I'm getting it. And in your sheepskin rug. Sorry, coat. Coat. Don't hurt me. I was inserting the coat, not the beard. But anyway, these guys have just beaten the, the proverbial snot out of each other. If I hadn't seen this match before I would say that Mark True has been beating him that hard as trousers for him. Credit where credit's due for such a small person Nino is taking an utter beating that was a claw down the back I have a lot of time for that yeah well the back elbow was no oh no slouch either oh, I think they might I think they might he seems quite popular but as he not oh my god oh, <laughs> but as he knocks up the back, I know that True's doing whatever he's doing. They've both got... Oh, stop it. They've got enough They've got enough to keep going, I hope. But because they do the flip-flop fly stuff, they're used to hurting their bodies themselves. So, you know, that'll stand them in good stead for when they're getting their butt kicked by somebody else. It's a case of who last... Oh, who can take the most punishment? Who's your money on? I've got to put my money on Mark True. The man's using some techniques that I myself have... <laughs> yeah, all right, mate. Just, all right. Just as I say it. He's using some techniques that... He's using some techniques. He's not... You, you can't do that. <laughs> I could try. Somebody would die. <laughs> I once dived through the middle rope. High fire, then. Going for the middle rope plancher. <laughs> Excalibur would be proud. Yeah, he goes to that dive, ladies and gentlemen. It's like a tope suicida, but not even close. Oh, that drop kick there, straight into the top buckle, head butts, forearm smash. He's got tiny arms by comparison, but oh, the amount of speed and the. Oh, look out, duck. Goes behind, goes behind again, sends him off. What? What a rebound. Oh, oh, oh no! <laughs> You know when you, when you kick somebody that hard and they kind of do a, a standing shoot star but land flat on their face? That's quite impressive. Pretty where it's due, I suppose. Look, just shut up about your toe pace to see the middle right, right? Exactly. This, you can't do it. What's he going for? 
Uh, ow, ow, slingshot, no. Oh, is he, is he, oh, look out, look out, look out. Oh, nice. I've said it before. Oh, no, good night. Good night. He's not moving. A beautiful one and done. Well, hardly. There is movement from Nino. Oh, but don't. That's just the muscles moving. They do that. Okay, and I suppose you stand up on your own body weight by yourself when you're unconscious, oh. do you? Nope. Got him. What's he going for? Get out. Get out. Get that sounded like something just popped. And I don't mean the crowd, I mean that's like a shoulder. Or a disc in the back. It's not often you hear Nino verbalise, but he's, he's well up for that. Oh, God! I just saw something. Have you seen the gouges down his back from the, the back claw rake earlier? I know Nino's pale, but they're, they're glowing red right now. Beautiful red lines. Look out. No. No, I thought he was going for a tornado to the UK there, but he's got... He's a whole... Oh. No, look at the strength. Oh, no, no, roll, roll through. Come on. Again, give my credit to Matt Ball. He's there to react to these uh, flippy floppers as soon as they get a pinning combination. But And he counts the shoulders as well, not the feet, which is always good. Oh, come on, mate. I'm only joshing you. Was that the DPD? That was the DPD. Doesn't deliver. And that's not an order at a restaurant either. This that's is why I use FedEx. Well, you can't use the Royal Mail because it's striking again. Even they don't deliver on a Sunday. <laughs> They're striking on their day off. <laughs> yes, anyway. Oh, oh what, what's he throwing away now? What's this issue? Do you throw away a sock? Oh, he's losing his temper. And he's jawing with the crowd. Good. Let's pick on a little kid. Well, Nino's getting his breath back. Is he going for that, like, airborne massive elbowy thing again? Nope. Oh, that's oh. a way to break your knees. Nope. Nope. Tornado. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. Bot by True. But out the ring, which is not where Nino wants him. Nope. He clawed to try and reach him, but after being spiked straight on the top of his bumps. That's a head, by the way. Oh, right. He, he, oh, dear. Yeah, I don't know. Like, I don't want this match to end based on a count out. I think that's unfair to the fans, and I don't think either of these two flippers will want to lose it on the flip. Absolutely. Don't do it, Nino. Oh, is he going to throw him back in? Oh, thank God for that. Oh, see, I, I think he should just uh, drop it on his head. Oh, brilliant. DQ and concussion and probably kill the guy. Absolutely amazing. Win to win. Yeah, I'm not sure killing somebody would be a win for anybody. In the words of Dominic Toretto, it doesn't matter if you win by an inch or a mile, winning is winning. He also says it's also about family. He says a lot of things. I, I switch off. I'm not really a fan of the fast and uh, delirious. But anyway, he's got him trapped. What? Maybe. I think if he was more worried about like dealing with the man that he's got clutched. Look at those scratches. They're even worse than HD. But I'd be more worried instead of messing around with the crowd and picking on little kids like some sort of weirdo that he'd be focused on Nino because he's already proven that... That's some serious strength though. I'd have dropped him. But then again, I'm a ref. I shouldn't be touching him. Oh, headbutt. Oh, he might have broken Beautiful. his nose. Beautiful skull on skull action. The bridge of the nose. That would have hurt. All of it. Look at that. What's he doing? Oh, oh, what's he going for? He's going by Mark True. I thought he was going for, is he going for the Death Valley driver? No, he's going for a spin out. Spin out. Uh, spin out. Oh, oh, oh my God. God! That is what you call karma. No, that's what you call his dead gym. Like Star Trek. Oh, he's going for that again. He's going for the DPD. One more time. Whoa, pinned him. It's cradled. Got the legs, the leverage. Oh, he's done it. 
God. Whew. Oh dear. I'm shocked and appalled. Oh, I genuinely thought someone was going to get kicked in the face then. But it was a head bump. There's please. absolutely no reason whatsoever. Is there any bro is there any blood? The mark shouldn't have won that. That was a hell of a match. Come on, True. That's no, no, it, what's true. he doing? Come That's on. it. Finish no. him off. No, shake his hand. That no, was a awesome. Finish him off. No. No. no Come on, boys. That was a cheap Let's win. Let's shake hands, boys. That was a cheap win. A win's a win, right? Ah, quiet now. Come on, boys. Shake it off. Shake hands. That was an absolute banger. Punch him in the mouth. Shut up. Doesn't need you to coach him. Tashlish tash. That's not German. There you oh. go. I just hope. Oh, no, come on. Cuddles. So I thought you hit him then. <laughs> I It's going to be one of these cliche moments, Nick, where you turn around and say that everybody's a winner. Um, after that match, I don't know about them, but I'm knackered. Shattered. Shattered. Oh, your stash has slipped. No, it's it's getting caught in your head, sir. Nice. Great show of respect there from the boys. Love it. They are definitely, definitely, definitely taking over Brit Rest with their own unique style. Being a loser is another.